Hey everyone, Merrick's here, bringing you another video. This one, uh, gonna be doing my prize wall raid for the month. I have the MLC maxed, have most of the, um, t-shirts that I'm gonna get. I mean, there'll be a few more with the Flash Feud this weekend, and then the Faction, um, events ending and stuff, but, um, we're gonna snag a bunch of those resources. One of my favorite parts of the month. Uh, gonna start out, get all of these premium combo twos, TP and Blitz tickets. There's 10 of them, and so this will give us 1,000 TP, 3,300 uh, t-shirts used. And it's been a it's been an interesting month. I got Dusty at the 3k uh, shard recruit, so five star bronze. Uh, so I'm happy about that. Going into this weekend event, it looks like Hitman is going to be very obtainable. Uh, if I can get him, that would be great. And I got uh, Yoko. Um, there have been a few now at this point um, Hall of Fame tokens this month. Uh, I wish there had been more. The biggest uh, downer for me with Hall of Fame cards is I I would like to build more of them, but it is uh, very difficult to get the tokens required. Um, so it's been a so-so month. If bread ends up being obtainable, I feel like it's a lot better month, but I also feel like maybe a little bit of a miss on the available Hall of Fame tokens. Even though there was more, um, there wasn't as many as I was hoping for, so... We're going to snag these small coin packs next. It's actually a better um, value than the medium one next to it. Go ahead and grab the medium one next to it now. This is probably it for the premium. Um, I don't think we'll be coming back. Um, small TP poster uh, packs will be uh, at the end if I have anything left over. And by the end, I mean after the MLC um, is over and all of the final stuff comes in. Definitely grabbing the level up special. Great deal there. Um, very likely to get, um, not this one, very likely to get combo pack, um, one for 780. Uh, combo pack three is likely to happen too, uh, because that's a 100 TP for 120 t-shirts. So you can get, um, you can get another thousand TP buying all of those. And a combo pack four, I don't love the value on, so that'll be uh, probably at the end. I do like getting these because I love my having my props, so I'm going to go ahead and snag these right now. Uh, very useful for tours. It keeps me from having to level up or strap guys I don't want to use, so... Uh, good value for me there. We'll be trying to hopefully get at least two of those. Um, we need 6,400 for two. So we have 8,400 uh, left to play with. So I think I want to get the large TP next. Each one of these is 500. And there's six of these. And that's going to use uh, expensive 5,400, but it'll also give us uh, 3,000 TP. Uh, so it is expensive, but TP is a premium.
Okay. Let's see where we're at. 9.4k. So let's go ahead. Actually want to snag these now. And we're 200 short. And I may just call it in wait. Uh, so I can get the last massive. Um, later. In the MLC here. Because 200 I should get. You know just from the events this weekend. Let alone the faction stuff. Um, although this gives me 1000 TP for 1200. So I think that's going to be better value. And this gives me 3 million coin for 780 and 1,000 blitz tickets. So this is almost, these two in, combined are almost as much as this one. So on second thought, I think I will just go ahead and get those two. As that's almost, um, what, 1,200, 2,000? Like two-thirds of the price. Um, so... And the TP is more spread around. So I think that ends up being the smarter play. So I'm going to go ahead and actually change my mind and get both of those. And then I'll see where um, where I end up after the MLC. If I get enough to get the last one of those. Or if I end up buying different packs. Like maybe end up getting this one or whatever. Um, this one I don't care about. It's overpriced. So we're going to do that actually. A million less coin and the same amount of TP for uh, like 1,200 t-shirts less. Yeah, and uh, it's not worth 1,200 t-shirts for a million coins. So. And we can open this stuff up, which is always fun. Well, at least for me, it's fun. Kind of see where I'm at on TP and decide, um, start deciding who I want to push next month. Um, when your projects all are like five star bronze and five star silver, you end up needing a lot of TP and coin to get them ready for the next level. Uh, in fact, so much so that even doing the coin and the TP events um, and maxing all of them, I don't have as many guys probably ready as I'm going to need for talent up. So there is that. Yeah, so mostly what's left, I don't love very much of it. There's the small TP pack, which is what I'll end up getting if I don't get uh, 2200 more. Uh, which I probably won't get. I would love to be able to get that last one by the end. But overall, um, I got all the stuff I wanted. Um, so not too bad. Let's uh, take a look at my current TP situation. And we'll do like a before and after kind of uh, snapshot. You can see I have tons of blue. So really hoping I get... Uh, Brett, as he's a great use of the blue and the green, which are my two highest. So, Hall of Fame Brett, that is. So, yeah. Uh, I had a nice comeback on black this month. It was pretty low. Red was really, really low, and it's actually uh, much higher than it was. And uh, yellow kind of kind of maintained. And uh, purple I ended up using a ton of. Purple was my highest at the start of last month. So I've done a good job uh, alternating and uh, getting that down. So let's see, uh, after we open these, uh, where I end up. And we'll start with the these. Do, 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 do. 11 red and green. Nice spread. I like it when it's even. It's a good amount.
for those curious, uh, my my tooth seems to be healing okay. I'm not in too much pain today. And I can talk much better now that half of my face isn't numb. I'll just open these as long as we're in here. The other nice thing about getting the um, props is you never end up being short on these because you're getting 150 every month. Wish they would do some version of this with the four or five four star gold tokens. Yeah, four star gold tokens. Um, wouldn't have to be 150, although that would be amazing. And uh, let's start with these uh, tens. It looks like, or actually, let's just open these two fives. Not really. Not even gonna track them on my spreadsheet. Um. So it looks like we got, what, 1,890 TP here? Let's see what kind of spread we get. Should be around 300 of each. Yeah, pretty close. We got 370 yellow, 30 purple, and red. 320 black. That was nice, uh, actually. Um, in order, I have TP. I almost completely got it. Uh, purple is my lowest. Um, and then yellow and then red. So that was a pretty nice spread, actually. I'd take that every time. Blue being my highest. Okay. What do we got next? Uh, not a ton here. 25s. We only have 10? Yeah. Hundred blue, fifty black. You definitely need to spend a bunch of blue next month. Fifty red. Um, I'm gonna probably be looking to level Dusty a bunch, and like I said, hopefully I get Brett, because uh, both of them would would be towards the top of next month's big TP projects anyway. Okay, now we got, what, 2,500 of the 50s? Big money, no whammy. Go, some purple, huh? Oof, didn't listen at all, but uh, that's awesome on the red count, so I will take it. And being that I'm going to work on Dusty, I'll need a bunch of black anyway, so nothing wrong with that. Sorry, just adding up my TP as we go here. Although, if you guys have seen this, you know that's kind of normal for me. Now, because the spread on that was was blue, it was so high and red, I think I'm going to open these thousands now out of order. Uh, and purple was low, so I'm kind of gambling that I'll get a purple here. And you can see that worked out amazingly well. I got my two highest colors. <laughs> should have should have waited till after I opened the others. It's all right though because in the end I'll end up using it all. Um, so TP is TP, and it just changes what I farm <clears throat> when I farm what color I farm. All right, here's the big one. Pretty even spread. Um, I like that we got a thousand of the purple. Not as much TP bags to open this month, really, um, as in past months. I think there was more given out, um, like that auto opened because my TP was pretty high to start with. So this isn't like an exceptional amount. Um, yeah, for sure. Just looking at the, the quantities. Uh, 2,000. And yellow. Green's easy enough to add up. Of 
Boy, purple was my lowest uh, one that I got, so... So that could have been better. And we got... Okay, so ended up getting 1,980 red, uh, 2,045 yellow, 2,570 blue, 2,220 black, 2,595 green, and only 1,530 purple. So not as much purple as I would have liked, but that's okay. I, I just built a bunch of purple guys, so I don't think I'll need a ton of it next month. And let's see what the spread looks like now. So lots of blue and green, like I said. Black is solid, yellow and red are okay, and um, purple is just below 10,000. I like ending the month, uh, if possible, above 10 of each color. And I don't think I have a ton of purple that I need to put into anyone um, that I'm, I'm working on. I think Stacy has a, all of her purples done, um, so that's good. Sammy's done, um, and those are my tricksters who tend to use a lot of purple. So, uh, overall, I'm pretty happy with the spread. Like I said, now I know I need to build a bunch of these two colors next month and try and avoid um, this one, and so on. So, anyway, guys, um, hopefully you enjoyed this video. Hopefully your prize wall raid goes well, and uh, I do appreciate you watching. Remember to like, subscribe, and share, as that really helps me out. Other than that, good luck out there.